everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Lauren Hess, and this is Comcast Newsmakers. Our topic today is the Michigan Renewable Schools Program. Here to discuss it with us is the Director of Energy Works Michigan, Emil Lautzana. Thank you so much for joining us today. Glad to be here. What exactly is, to begin with, Energy Works Michigan? Energy Works Michigan is a nonprofit technical resource helping schools and others achieve energy efficiency and install practical renewable energy systems. And uh, you have a program called the Michigan Renewable Schools Program, which essentially does the same thing, or uh, yep. not so much? Well, we received a grant from the Public Service Commission, a part of uh, the Department of Labor, Energy, Labor, and Economic Growth, to uh, work with over 60 schools statewide doing energy efficiency improvements, uh, installing renewable energy systems, and doing pro teacher professional development and other uh, activities with, with students. So it sounds like there's a bunch of different aspects to what you do. First of all, you go in and you might send in engineers, contractors to actually improve the, the physical energy efficiency, heaters, air conditioners, that type of thing? Correct. We, we uh, hired several Michigan-based engineering and architectural firms to perform detailed energy analyses of schools. These analyses will uh, have cost-effective specific improvements recommended for implementation at the schools. Then we work with the school decision makers to come up with a time frame and an action plan to implement those improvements, which can lead to significant energy savings at, at their facilities, allowing uh, money to go back into the classrooms. And I would imagine everything from changing out light bulbs to perhaps new windows, uh, expensive and inexpensive fixes all the way across the That's board. That's right. That's right. Mechanical systems optimizations, uh, lighting upgrades, sy uh, systems controls, things like that. And then in addition to that, you mentioned you hold workshops sort of educating those who work within the buildings on how they can help to uh, be more, uh, uh, sort of uh, use energy more efficiently? Yeah, that's correct. When, when working with school districts, uh, we find it's really important to work with the full spectrum of stakeholders, everything from the, the district administrators, to principals, teachers, students, and even parents. So we have two main program offerings, but we also have sub-programs within that that engage teachers in professional development, contests for students, such as a recent uh, student film contest. We'll be running that again this fall, essay contest. So we want to get everybody involved in the schools uh, working to green their facilities and learn about really the, the future of our economy. You mentioned you're working with 60 schools right now, but this is a statewide program, correct? That's right. We're working with uh, schools across the full spectrum of Michigan, from small rural communities in the Upper Peninsula, uh, farm communities in central Michigan, to urban districts, uh, Kent, uh, Kent ISD, as well as Detroit Public Schools. So we, we designed the program specifically to try and reach everybody that we could. It's really it's a pilot program to see what can be done, what do they need. Part of this is just figuring out how can we help uh, understand their situation and bring resources to, to move them forward. And the ultimate goal being saving the district, uh, ultimately the state, everybody, uh, taxpayers' money? Well, that's the, certainly one immediate goal, but even more future-seeking, we want to help schools become uh, engaged in comprehensive sustainability. We want, we're working right now in energy, uh, saving dollars, teaching kids about uh, green jobs, helping them get to that, that green career path. But, but ultimately, we have food service, we have transportation, we have the curriculum, we have the way teaching is happening now. We're moving towards an inquiry-based education system, a new model of education. We need to get resources to teachers to understand, to get them more training, to be comfortable and effective in that, that new teaching environment. So this is, we see this as a start on a, on, a, on a path to comprehensive sustainability in our schools. And we think that's the place we should be starting with this as opposed to an afterthought. Okay. Thank you so much for joining us today. Great concept and would love to see more Michigan schools go green. Thanks again. Great to be here. Today's Comcast Newsmaker was Emil Lutzana, the Director of Energy Works Michigan. Thank you.